Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. It is time for Color and Create with us, You Rock Art, hosted by Rosemary over at Rosemary's You Rock Art. She picked a page for us to color this week, and this is my page, a little pot of honey um, with the honey dipper and a couple of bees and flowers. I used my alcohol markers. Um, didn't turn out as well as I wanted to. This particular blue marker I was using seemed really, really wet and I thought well it'll look better when it dries but it really didn't in this middle part so <laughs> there's my page it sure was fun though all right and then for the create part this week I have been working on a couple of different swaps one of them I am doing a uh, bee theme I'm not finished this is not all I'm sending my partner but this is a few things I did get done I made a be beaded pin with uh, some of these bee beads and I did put a little bee charm on there, a little honeycomb bee charm. So I thought that turned out cute. I did make a bookmark. I have not put any kind of embellishments on this. Um, I normally like to just let the paper be the star of the show on bookmarks, or I will decorate with stickers or something very flat, but I've got that. Uh, I made one of these little notepad holders. Um, I've got the die that creates the little holder for these, and these are I think three or three and a half by five little writing tablets that you get at the Dollar Tree. Um, and I did put a little charm here on the bottom and I decorated simply with some uh, enamel dots and that's a little Tim Holtz uh, sentiment there, stay simple, and then a little bow and a little flat back bee. And I also love to make these little folders out of, well, I call it a folder. It's more of a pocket. Um, so a while back, everybody was finding these clear pockets at Target. I never could find them at my store, but I did get some on Amazon. And I think they're about a three and a half by three and a half. So I just cut this paper at four by six, and then I make a little two inch flap here um, and stick it down. And I filled it with stickers. And then um, I do like to use double-sided paper. I don't always, but I do like to use that. And then I have the crafty words from oh it's a die set and the mind or the word escapes me right now um, and then I had a couple of little bee stickers that I stuck on there and I just filled it full of bees and bee stickers and like I said I just make these really simply and then I did put a little bee charm on there for the closure part as well so I have been coloring and creating. Hope everyone did have a wonderful weekend and I will see you all soon. Bye-bye.